Hi everybody, it's Ivan with Vine Skills, and I want to share with you two updates to Lead Docket. They were recently released that, in my opinion, are super, super helpful for, especially for the users that use Lead Docket and File Vine together. A few of our clients in, at Vine Skills, they love this, and it's a huge time saving for them. So this is not, by the way, you may be thinking that this is the automations and lead forms, which is the new, uh, one of the newest releases for lead docket. They have now an automation rules, which is really cool in a lead forms, which is also really interesting, especially for mass towards firms. They, they've been really liking this, but that's not what I want to talk about. <laughs> uh, what I really want to talk about is one release that is about a month ago. Uh, they released this, and you can see it here on your announcements, uh, this connect roles and permissions with Filevine. You may have, you know, I don't know if you saw that, you may have missed, but what this means is that now LeadDocket can actually push the attorney, paralegal, uh, whatever roles you have in LeadDocket, you can now push them inside your teams in Filevine. So you can give them roles, you can assign them a, a follower, an admin, or all, all that automatically so there's no more to your intake team pushing that case to file vine and then having to go in there and manually assign the teams to that project that is now done automatically here through your roles management right here in lead docket the other really interesting update to lead docket and this is actually as of this week you can now push settlement information from your file vine back into lead docket from collection sections. The use is not used to be possible before, but what that means is that from now on, you have some really, really powerful reporting that you can get to track your settlements uh, for every case that you close in file vine. You'll get really nice settlement tracking. Average case duration is a really interesting uh, feature in lead docket because now file vine and lead docket can be fully connected and it can be tracking the life of that case through file vine. And once you settle that case in file vine, you push that information back into lead docket and then you have your ROI, right? That everybody's looking for. So it was a huge update now in lead docket and you can push that from settlement from collection sections. So I hope that helps. Um, if, if any questions, feel free to reach out. We're always here to help.